6 o'clock in the morning. Pretty early considering the last trip I had to be up at about 2 p.m. So yeah, this is early. Starting a four day trip today, going from here to Pittsburgh, then to Minneapolis where I have a two and a half, three hour set. Yeah, that'll be fun. And then to Rochester, about 10 hours or so. Shouldn't be too bad, but you know, anything can happen. So, see you in a bit. So I get to my gate here, the other side of the airport, and they changed my gate back to where I just was. So now I gotta get my ass up and get moving. All right, guys, I'm here. Made it to the plane, did my checks. Just waiting uh, for the flight attendant to get here before we start boarding. Shouldn't be too bad. Don't have any problems so far. Cause I shouldn't say that. Don't wanna jinx it. We're good though. See you guys in a bit. Guys, I have made it to Minneapolis. I think I have like two hours, 40 minutes, like three hours. I think I might find something to eat, I'm not sure. I'm trying not to spend money I don't have, but I'm hungry. So, we'll see what happens. I think I'm gonna go chill out or something. I don't know. I'll catch you guys later though. Bye. Chester. <sighs> I'm so tired. Guess it's kind of a nice view or whatever. <sighs> if you can see it back there. In my closet in bed. I mean, today wasn't too bad. Three flights, Pittsburgh, Minneapolis, Rochester. The two hour 40 minutes sitting mini kinda, kinda got to me. I was falling asleep a little bit. We're here, we're good. I'm gonna get changed and I'll talk to you guys in a bit. See ya. All right guys, what's going on? When I started this, I didn't even realize I kind of need to introduce myself. My name is Ron and I am a Detroit-based flight attendant. So, I'm not very good at these introductions if if that's what you want to call them. Not really sure where to go from here. I mean, today wasn't too bad. First day of a four day trip. First one wasn't too bad. I mean, it wasn't that long. Our second leg was probably the longest and that was only like an hour and a half. And this last one was like 20, 30 minutes. I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do today. Not that there's much to do out here. I mean, I just ate. I'm still feeling that Chick-fil-A I just ate. There's nothing really to do around here besides sit in my room and watch TV or whatever. I was at this overnight like less than a week ago. We didn't have to report downstairs till like three o'clock in the afternoon. But tomorrow morning we got a report at like 5 a.m., which is sick. Sick. What I'm hoping is that creating for this channel will help you guys get to know me more and I can take you along with me on my journey. Well, work, journey, whatever you want to call it. There's actually an IMAX across the street and what I really need to do is go watch Incredibles 2, even if it's by myself. I mean, that's there's something to do, but my lazy ass won't. Probably.
All right, good morning, guys. It is like four, not like, it's four o'clock in the morning. I gotta be downstairs in like 20 minutes. Shouldn't be bad. Kinda tired, but we'll get through it. I'll catch you guys later. What's up guys, I'm here in Atlanta, finally. We stopped and got coffee. Now we're on our way to Knoxville and on our way to Tulsa. I just made it to Knoxville just to find out that people can't get their bags because the cargo bin won't open. Lovely. Just a few minutes, we're gonna be on our way back to Atlanta and then to Tulsa for the night. Catch you guys later. Tulsa. It's alright or whatever. I'm actually not sure what I'm about to do right now. I think the crew wants to go somewhere. Might go out, get something to eat, go do something. Get out of this room for a bit, get some fresh air. I don't know. We'll see. It's been a long day, a really long day. And I actually didn't think it was going to be that bad. Our first leg wasn't too bad. Let's see, where did we start? Rochester to Atlanta. That wasn't too bad. Atlanta to Knoxville. When we got to Knoxville, the cargo bin wouldn't open. So people couldn't get their bags for like an hour. We had to wait for the cargo bin to get fixed. And then we were finally able to get back to Atlanta. And then from there, we had a long ass flight here to Tulsa. But I mean, I'm not gonna complain. We made it here. I'm really uh, like planning on doing something, even if it's just go down to the gym for a little bit. We all know that might not happen. <sighs> something, something, I don't know. I need to go get something to eat. I'm gonna leave tomorrow at like 4.30, 4.30 in the morning, five o'clock. These early report times are ridiculous. Honestly, no matter what time you go to bed, if you wake up at four o'clock in the morning, four or five o'clock in the morning, you're just done. What is going on guys? Just got out of the shower. The other flight attendant and I actually went out, had a pretty good time. Yes, I actually went out. Went had some Mexican, had a few drinks. There was like some hookah bar close by. We went there, chilled out and smoked a little bit. Gonna chill out and try and go to sleep. Gotta be up at like 4 a.m. Catch you guys in the morning. Good night. Yeah, I definitely went to bed way too late last night. It's whatever though. Today I go from here to Mini to Columbus, back to Mini, and then I am actually deadheading, not working the flight to Milwaukee for the night. I have to be downstairs in about 15 minutes, as much as I don't want to. What's up guys, I am in Milwaukee. We had a delay this morning due to some thunderstorm, whatever, but we're good now. I'm here. I'm about to go find something to eat because I'm gonna die of hunger in a minute. It is so nice out here. I need to get out more. The food that I ordered from is like right around the right around the corner from the hotel, so it's not that bad. Which is probably why I'm actually walking. I'm a 
sitting there waiting, waiting, and waiting, waiting for my order number, and I was looking at the wrong number, and all the time I was just sitting there. I'm on my way back to my room right now. I should just relax and do nothing. All right, guys. It's been a long day. Gotta be downstairs in a few hours. Wow, that sounds rough. Which, yeah, super early. Going back to Detroit and then doing a Birmingham turn. Birmingham? Yeah, Birmingham. See you guys in the morning. Good night. Good morning, guys. It is 4.30, almost 4.30. All done, finished getting ready. I'm gonna head downstairs and get some breakfast. I'll see you guys later. <laughs> Finish like one. Here in Detroit for like three hours. This music is really loud. Going to Birmingham and coming back, and I'm done. Here for like another half hour, 45 minutes. Have one more turn, and then we're done. Finally. I honestly wish I could just be done now, but it's all good. Just a couple more left. This trip's been long though. It's been a good one, but a long one. Birmingham and back. Well, I am on the plane. Everything's all set up and ready to go. Just waiting on the other flight attendants to get here. We should be getting going soon. This flight's like an hour 20, so it's not bad. But yeah, once we get back, this trip is done. Off for a couple days, so it's pretty nice. Catch you guys later. Yeah, I'm really done. I'm so glad to be on. I'm gonna wait for my Uber. I'm on my home finally. It's the longest trip of my life. See you guys next time.